What up guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to perfect your trade loops. So if you clicked on this video, then you've learned tray flips, but you're trying to make them look nicer or get them more consistent. If you haven't learned how to tray flip yet, then watch my tutorial on it, and that'll teach you how to tray flip, and then come back to this one and watch how to perfect it. So right now, I'm guessing that your tray flips look something like this. But you want them to look like this. Well, in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to do that. The most important thing you need to know to perfect your tray flips is to not try so hard. When I first learned them, I would just scoop as hard as I can and just jump and hope I land on the board, completely not catching it, and land somewhere on the nose. So just chill out, loosen up, you know, get warmed up first, and then start trying it, but don't try so hard. Just give it a nice little scoop. And make sure you're leaning back and pushing the board in front of you because I don't think I've ever met someone who didn't start landing on their nose right when they learned tray flips. So just make sure you're leaning back and pushing your board in front of you. And also angle your heel up, because this will make you get higher pop and uh, scoop faster. So that's also good to know. And if you're doing the tray flip with your front foot, like you're flicking it a whole bunch, and it looks kind of weird, then definitely go watch my how to tray flip tutorial. It's, I linked it in the bio. And make sure you have the right foot position with your toes hanging off on the back of your tail, not in the pocket, and then your front foot somewhere around capable position. And then once you've warmed up and loosened up and you've started trying it, um, and you're getting pretty close, like you're starting to land better, practice um, like scooping your back foot out because it'll make it look a little nicer and you get that front foot catch. And then yeah, just like mess around with it see what you like better, see what you think looks better, because there's multiple ways to do a tray flip and multiple ways to make a tray flip look better. So yeah, just follow these steps and try to land better, and then you try to make it look as clean or steezy as you want to make it. But these steps should make it so that you're not landing on your nose anymore and that you're starting to catch the board and it's starting to look better. And um, if there's any questions, just let me know in the comments and uh, I'll answer them. Yeah, so I hope this helped you learn how to perfect your tray flips. And if it did, then drop a like and then comment down any tutorials you want me to do or any trick perfections or just any videos. And then yeah, have a great day, peace out.